restrictions, it is nothing short of a miracle that the worldwide broadcast of the 2020 DMZ Peace Festival has been made possible. Majin DMZ Peace Festival Tiga Radio Paramil, Birok Mali Ichima. Tell me then, Chichap Yoroko Nil Manaso, Umwan Hakil Kite Kamida. At this time, I'd like to introduce Mr. Rick Shin, the biggest supporter of GCS Pan America chapters and the Secretary General of World Taekwondo Pan America. Greetings from World Taekwondo Pan America. I am, my name is Rick Shin, Secretary General of World Taekwondo Pan America. I'd like to congratulate Dr. Cho and the sponsors of Gungme Ilbo for this festival, making it possible. At the same time, through this festival, we're taking a step closer for the unification of two Koreas, unifying one day. So once again, congratulations, and thank you for the support. Hello, sir. Thank you very much. My name is Edina Lenz, and I'm representative of GCS International Denmark Chapter. I'm very honored to speak on behalf of Europe, together with my sister Lisa Lenz. And I would like to take an opportunity to speak about one of the most important topics on Earth, world peace. Peace on Earth is something that we all should strive for to achieve, one way or another. Even though I'm privileged enough to say that from the part of the world where I come from, we do not need to think about or reflect on the notion of peace on a daily basis. While those who are less fortunate suffer, hoping and praying for peace to enter their lives one day. Those who have been victimized by war by human abuse or any other kind of inhumanities. They desperately need our support and encouragement to believe that peace can be restored. Thank you so much, sir. Hello, everyone. I'm Yohas Hashimika. I'm very pleased to continue Ms. Adina's speech. As martial artists and representatives of a great spirit of Taekwondo, We do not believe that peace is an unachievable entity, some kind of utopia. We believe that peace is a state of mind that can be reached through action. That is why we think that it's important for us to take actions towards promoting global peace, despite cultural, religious, social, and political differences. Let's promote peace, goodwill, and friendship together through Taekwondo. Let's work together on this important cause because when we are united, we are stronger. Thank you. Well, my name is uh, from India, GPS uh, uh, family. We are extremely thankful to, to the Cook Mill Board CEO, the dear one boy, and GPS International President Dr. Cho for organizing the 2020 DNZ Speed Festival as well for extending an invitation to India. Taekwondo as a sport embodies the spirit of peace, respect, and self-discipline. In this current ongoing pandemic COVID-19, the fact that the organizing committee strives to fulfill their mission of developing peace through sport is really appreciable and massively commendable. Despite our cultural differences, sport has always been universal language. It has been and will always be powerful tool to promote peace, tolerance, and understanding. It bridges the gap between people across the boundary, culture, religion, and unite us all as a one. Sport plays an important role in the society in every part of the world for its capability to convey basic rules and essential values for a peaceful coexistence. 
It promotes and teaches us all tolerance, team spirit, loyalty, and fair play. In addition, sport plays is an essential in the building character which transcends our society and nation as it instills the value of discipline, endurance, courage, and self-motivation. Sport is known to be the most unifying rule for a peace in the world. It creates hope, heals bonds, makes pieces, tenses, and helps rise above our differences. It is now more important than over considering all that is going on around the world to be part of something that help us become a valuable citizen of humanity. I thankful to all of you and uh, wish you all the best for 2020 with uh, the DMD. Hello to everybody back in Seoul, back in Korea and everybody around the world. Uh, representatives of uh, GCS uh, chapters around the globe. It is my privilege to share this meaningful day with you around the globe, reunited over the commemoration of the 2020 EMC Peace Festival. On behalf of the GCS International Honduras chapter, I would like to congratulate the Cook Green Day CEO, Jay Wan Young and GCS International President Chong Wong Cho on the joint organization of the 2020 DMZ Peace Festival. In this transcendental day, speaking to you from Honduras, Central America, I would like to share with you an extract of an article published by Dr. Surya Nath Prasad on the historic meeting held in our neighboring country, the Republic of Costa Rica, in 1981. I quote, A South Korean world-renowned peace thinker, Dr. Young Sik Cho, founder and chancellor of Gyeonggi University, Republic of Korea, and one of the initiators, founders of International Association of University Presidents, was the original and sole initiator and advocate of the UN International Day and Year of Peace in 1986. Dr. Cho's dream for world peace through education has become true in reality when his basic concepts of International Day and Year of Peace, which he presented in his keynote speech entitled The Great Imperative, Peace is more precious than triumph. Access on Peace at the 51st, the commemorative ceremony for the United Nations Day on October 24, 1996, at the UN headquarters, New York, USA, in recognition of International Day and Year of Peace for the first time in the history of the UN. To conclude, I want to seize this opportunity to extend my warmest salutations to the family of the GCS International Chapters. Representatives, with my best wishes of good health and prosperity to everyone.
my name is Siyan Kolmuller. As emissary of the GCS Career South Chapter in GCS Panamerica, it is an honor for me to speak here today in support of the DMC Creek Movement. This is a precious gift, something to cherish and easily got, but also something we should never take for granted. That is why we are so grateful for the peace efforts between North and South Korea. We commend everyone for their efforts at achieving this important milestone that gives us hope for a brighter future, a world where all of humanity is united as a family and where together we strive for the betterment of all. That is what the Taekwondo community stands for. The GCS Pure South and GCS Pan America are no exception. That is why it is our mission, our duty, and our honor to support all future DMZ movements together with the UN Peace Corps. The gradually the pandemic has made it impossible for us to come together physically to show our support for the DMZ movement. But we are all still joined in spirit and through this virtual meeting, we have come together with one common goal, world peace. We will continue striving to fulfill our social responsibility to mankind to the quantum, thereby also honoring the GCS story. This is more precious than time. Well, we from Puerto Rico. I'm Elvin Landro, as a president of the GCS Puerto Rico chapter and Puerto Rico Taekwondo Federation. This is our honor to stand before you and be part of the peace and forth to Taekwondo between North and South Korea. As we stand in an era of uncertainty, on team is certain. Taekwondo know no boundary because peace are more precious than John. Uh, respected president of GCS International, all GCS family, it's a great pleasure and pride for me to be part of this DMG Peace Festival. Dear all, greetings from GCS Nepal chapter. This is Pratasan Serrana, the co-president of GCS Nepal chapter. First of all, I would like to congratulate you all on the auspicious occasion of this DMG Peace Festival. Coming from the birthplace of Lord Buddha, I a sample of peace, we believe unity and understanding only arise from peace rather than war and conflict. We GCS Nepal chapter and GCS International has always been serving the spreading the message of peace and prosperity within the whole Taekwondo family and out as well. With the very message of peace, Dr. Chung Cho, the president of GCS International, inaugurated a peace statue stood by GCS International and Nepal Taekwondo Association on 3rd August 2019, 20 on Sanguna, a temple in Kathmandu, Nepal. The location is also known as Monkey Temple, a very famous tourist area of Nepal, which is one of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites. We very much welcome you all to be a visit and take a memory of this from the site as well. Last but not the least, I would like to congratulate once again to all. Please, if you like. Hello, my name is Kisuri from Sri Lanka. I am here as a representative of GCS Sri Lanka sector. Peace is not everything, but without peace, everything is nothing. The, end, the unification of the world only divide the nation, the Korean Peninsula is the first of the world peace. Overcoming the division of Korean Peninsula and reunification are the first national task to be achieved through dialogue, exchange, and cooperation between the South and the North Korea. Everyone wants peace rather than war, but peace is hard to achieve and hard to keep. But we cannot and should not give up peace. We hope that two Korea will cooperate and contribute together to peace and prosperity of the world. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, first, uh, con congratulations on the 2020 uh, GMC Peace Festival by 
DAC International and Cookman uh, Ilbo Daily. Uh, my name is Edith Prato. I'm a senior vice president of uh, the Asia Journalist Association, NGO Matagal News, the home from Indonesia. From, from my experience, uh, uh, but uh, thank you very much for uh, Dr. Chang is inviting me uh, in uh, the DMCP Festival. Thank you very much. Uh, from the, my experience in releasing hostages during the conflict in Aceh, the role of the media in a conflict area is very relevant. The media must first have a co uh, courage to carry out in the depth of evaluation. They must be able to conflict message peaceful journalists, presenting facts to the genuine news, and keeping away from a prov provocative and bombastic news. Uh, this initiative should also be promoted uh, towards uh, people to people for modern. For example, during the Jews of Day, there was initiative to bring a separated family from North and uh, South Korea together. Uh, the culture approach uh, should be strengthened uh, with a music concert, a joint filmmaking, and so on. Not, another idea the both of common games uh, to blame Korean unification match in South and Korea and North Korea. Uh, sport diplomacy should be encouraged. I, I believe uh, uh, Dr. Kang can initiate for both uh, sport diplomacy uh, by Taekwondo diplomacy. The new drive for reunification must make uh, two countries move away from counterparties and all approach and encourage a positive and soft diplomatic by enhancing humanity and benefits of United Korean. I believe the terms of United Korea can be promoted fully by peaceful